Hello folks and welcome back to Let's Play Mass no Effect 2 Commander. Where apparently I have no messages, Commander, according to Kelly here I bumped into Zaid recently, quite the character Given how much violence and destruction that man's seen, he's surprisingly well adjusted Still, I wouldn't want to be alone with them <laughs> Anyway, what's up? Zaid's alright Is there anything I should know? Nothing right now, anything else, Commander? That'll be all That'll it's be always all. nice chatting with you Well when last we left off, we actually managed to recruit Archangel, otherwise known as Garrus. And now, I have a couple of choices to make. I'm going to attempt... <clears throat> I'm going to attempt to do Zaid's loyalty mission next. I'm hoping I will have enough Paragon to be able to pull this off. Let me, uh, let me just check that quickly. Oh, you know, I don't think I'm going to have enough. I'm going to try anyway. If I am unable to get this done via the Paragon path, I'll just come back to it later on. And you won't know that any of this happened. <laughs> Anyway, let's go and help Zaid. Enter orbit, land. Build your team. Each loyal squad member increases your chances of surviving the mission. Foreshadowing. Okay, so we've definitely got to take Zaid with us on this mission. And oh, we're up against Blue Suns. <sighs> I can drain the shields for the most part. Let's give uh, Garrus a nice clean looking suit there. I mean, I could take Miranda, Jacob. Actually, I could take Jacob because he's got squad ammo. Oh, that's one other thing. I've uh, switched out Dominate for armor-piercing ammo. As fun as Dominate was, I do feel as though um, it didn't fit the engineer class as well as I would have liked. So... Purchase a rank up there. We get two ranks and overload. We should nope. We can get your Torian Rebel up so far though, Garrus. That's fine. Uh, ah. Now, what are we gonna do for you, Zaid? Disruptive ammo or increase weapon damage? I think I'll take the weapon damage. Okay, have I got anything for myself? That's a negatory. Right, so Shepard, I'm happy with his getup. Need to change the incisor sniper rifle. I prefer them to have the single shot ones, don't know why. I'm gonna leave you with the, the Vindicator, actually. I do want to change the mat up for the Vindicator as well. Here we go. Sun's communications. Stay tight and look out for ambushes. Oh, we will that, Zaid. We will do that. Anything over here, first of all. That is a negatory. So, in this mission, we have to help Zaid track down somebody who did him. Squad Bravo. A shuttle landed near your location. Check it out. Here we go. Keep close. Did him a bit of a dirty in his past. And you can't use anything just yet, but 
I am going to equip arm-piercing bullets on both my pistol and my SMG. It's just annoying that when you use it, it doesn't activate it on all weapons. Shot in the back and left to rot. That's definitely Vito's style. Let's push ahead. Okay. Um, I'm going to switch your switch to sniper rifles. Switch up. Not as effective against shields, but <clears throat> powerful all the same. I can deal with the enemy shields. They just need to shoot them. <laughs> Command to Bravo, take a position. Likely these people are not runaways. And do a quick, quick save. Report to base. Armed intruders incoming at the southern checkpoint. Enemy! That one's down. Oh. Nice shot. Never saw me coming. I swear I heard Miranda's voice just then. That was weird. Did we wipe them out like Lickety Split or something? Sure. That might have been Welcome slightly on. overkill. Reinforcements incoming. We got your backs. Oh, okay. It was, uh, it was uh, the, one of the mercs that were talking. You got it. Zaid's down. Whoops. Get to cover. This game has seen fit to mess with my darn... Oh. <laughs> right, I'm going to have to get out of this one. Okay, they can curve. Impressive. There we go. Okay, right. I need to quick save and reload the game quickly. Ugh. I hate that blooming power bug. It's irritating. Okay. So I want that up in there. Three can be. Actually, I'm going to leave that at four because three eventually will be. My, um, oh, what you call it? AI hacking, that's the one. And I really should have picked up some ammo before, uh, saving and reloading, but never mind. That is just the way the cookie crumbles. Six thousand credits. Not gonna say no to that. This is Commander Santiago. If any of you retreat while the intruders are still alive, I'll kill you myself. Now get the hell back out there. 
Vito. Sounds like he hasn't changed. I get the feeling you have a past with this Vito. I knew he was a sadistic bastard back when we started the Blue Suns. The Suns only got meaner after he staged his little coup 20 years ago. So, yeah, we have a past. Why didn't anyone tell me you founded the Blue Suns? Because it's not common knowledge. Vito wiped me out of the records. He ran the books, I led the men. Worked real well for a while. Then Vito decided to start hiring Batarians. Cheaper labor, he said. Goddamn terrorists, I said. Twenty years is a long time to hold a grudge. A grudge? Vito turned my men against me. He paid six of them to restrain me while he put a gun to my head and pulled the trigger. For 20 years, I've seen that bastard every time I closed my eyes, every time I sighted down on a target, every time I heard a gunshot. Don't you call that a goddamn grudge? You survived a gunshot to the head? Yeah. <laughs> and you survived your ship getting disintegrated. A stubborn enough person can survive just about anything. Rage is a hell of an anesthetic. I can imagine. We'd better get moving. All squads mess at the gatehouse. Now! They know we're here. Bring it on, you son of a bitch! <laughs> and we will indeed bring it on. So, we need to carry on. It ain't gonna save you, me old chum, me old mucker, me old fella, me lad. Zaid Masani, you finally tracked me down. Vito. Don't be stupid, Zaid. I have a whole company of bloodthirsty bastards behind me, ready to kill or be killed on my command. Actually, take your shot. Give my men a reason to put you down like the mad dog you are. Again. What was that? Gone nearsighted old friend. Burn you, son of a bitch. <laughs> you just signed your death warrant, Masani. What the hell are you doing? Opening the gate. We don't sacrifice lives for the sake of the mission. There's always a better way. Like what? Wandering out in the jungle for hours looking for another way in. You want to waste time out here? Go ahead. I'm gonna kill Vito. You're endangering lives and the mission for your own selfish revenge. You really want to do this, Shepard? I had to knock you the hell out. But thanks to you, we have a burning refinery to save. Let these people burn. Vito dies, whatever the cost. Yeah, cost is pretty high. Impressive. And there we go. That wasn't all that impressive, Garrus, to be fair. It was more like a spray and pray. So I guess you could say my luck was impressive. <laughs> this I, I'm hoping I'm gonna be able to do this I hope I've got enough paragon to be able to convince Zaid help we're trapped we can't get to the gas valves to shut them off the whole place is gonna blow no time Vito's probably halfway to the shuttle docks by now you're willing to watch these people die? Damn right I am. We stop to help these people and Vito gets away. And if he gets away, I'm blaming you. We're here to free these people. We're going in. I knew this was a mistake. If we're gonna do this, we'd better get to it. 
There's a difference between a mistake and, you know, what you did, Masani. Right, let's see if we can't help these folks. Plus 17 Paragon. That might come in handy. Hey, got to bypass the door. Okay, chicken feet. Round thing. Ugh. Always so nerve-wracking. Oh, easy, easy. Going this route as well will get me another upgrade for my heavy weapon. Ugh. So we need to redirect the fuel. Them dudes is crispy critters. Okay, the fire extinguisher apparently is. Yeah, don't worry, we got you covered. No oh, easy, Tiger. Yep, we're gonna save these folks. Oh. And we won't be going that way to do it, that's for sure. Oh, hello. Palladium. I'm not going to say no to 400 extra palladium. This should come in handy. E, heavy weapon ammo upgrade. Oh, nuts. Oh, I missed a salvage thing back there. Oh, well. In fact, I think I missed a couple of salvage back there. Could have done with those credits, but, you know, life goes on. Now, that's the door you would have come through to track down Vito. Now, what's this? Oh, yeah. Oh. I don't want flamethrower equipped, dear boy. There we go. Dead as dead can be. About that firestorm. My arc projector. Yeah, I can't believe I missed that salvage back there. That's going to irritate me, that is, but nothing I can do about it now. Because I haven't got to save anywhere near that location. Right, that's everything in this room, at least. Definitely everything in there. Okay, now, apparently there's a cheeky little thing you can do here, whereby we can get the door to remain open, but, to be honest, I don't want to cheese the game too much. Huh, and I've just realised I didn't have to up at my ammo things equipped. Actually, he brought me with him, and he stands more of a chance now.
Okay, they're not as really well as I was expecting. No, Garrus, no. So we've got the Y-Man mech coming. Please let there be ammo around here somewhere. Hey! Okay, that was lucky. Alright, two rooms we can search here that will actually get us some stuff at least. Which is this one. And one other, I believe, on the opposite side. The other two rooms are empty. So exciting, isn't it? I'm just hoping I can pull off the Paragon option for Zaid. <laughs> oh god. I'm a little bit scared. But it should be okay. We'll be okay. Right, those other two rooms are empty as empty can be. There we go. You 
You just cost me 20 years of my life. Ah, son of a bitch! Oh. Zaid, you all right? The hell do you care? I'm fine. Now come on, get me out of this shithole. I'm not sure I need a man like you on my ship. If you didn't need me, Cerberus wouldn't have paid my fee. I'd do what I was paid to do. Nothing more, nothing less. Now stop screwing around. <sighs> Let's go. Thank you. You put your own goals ahead of the mission. That's not the way this works. I've survived this long watching my own back. No time to worry about anyone else. You're part of a team now, Zaid. There's no way we can do this unless we're all working together. You... You have a point. I'm not done with Vito. But I can put that behind me long enough to get your mission done. Let's get the hell out of here. I'm just surprised we didn't get the Normandy to shoot the thing from orbit, to be fair. <laughs> and we're away for another complete mission. Ooh, level 10 earned. Mission summary, Elfel Ashland Refinery on Zoraya has been liberated, though the company will have to spend millions to rebuild, although Vito Santiago escapes, Zoid has accepted Shepard's command and appears focused on the mission. So he now has Inferno Grenades, a new outfit, we now have access to the M451 Firestorm, a new upgrade for the heavy weapon, and oh, I lost out on 6,000 credits because I missed that scrap, but that's fine. We'll wait for this to load in. And there we have it, folks. Zoe's mission done and dusted. Uh, when we return, I'll probably have a brief chat with the crew, and then we'll move on to the next mission, which will be to free the convict. So for now, thank you very much for watching. Please feel free to like, comment, and subscribe, and hit that bell for those notifications. Take it easy. Bye-bye.